A big penultimate, very solid block on that right foot. Yoga's the truth. You heard it here first in the dunk life. Stevie Pioneers out here, you guys know that. And uh, it'll catch on. Mind, body, spirit. Or as I like to say, body, mind, spirit in that order. Oof. Uh, oof. Some people call it an empty gym. I call it heaven. High energy, empty gym, and a haircut. Mm. Be nice to your body. The nicer you are to the body, the better it responds. Don't rush the warm up. Oh, I forgot my tape measure. This was 9.9, but they fixed it. It could be 9.10, but we'll just keep it on 9.9. But either way, we're banging. Oh, like I said on Dunk Tip Tuesday, do what you gotta do today. Have the best day you can have now. Don't try to do the most today, do the best today. Did you guys see Nico dunk off for, from like a freaking squat, weird squat? Ooh. Crazy. Ah, let's go. Ah, let's go. Ah. Basically a walk up. So what I did there was my technique off the dribbles really hard to get perfect, but my lob is good. So I still wanted to do a drop step or a, a small approach to really focus on that last step without extending the penultimate. So I did a self bounce. Perfect. Just noticing that if I was more warm, I would do a high check, maybe later. Boing! Taking me a while to warm up. That's okay. Notice on the self bounce how I was really on top of my both of my feet straight away, and then on a dribble dunk, definitely hesitating on my hamstring. Getting when I add more speed, I start to hesitate. So just being super aware of that, so I make sure to not push it and stay in that stimulus sweet spot. Let's take a deep dive into the dribble dunks versus the lob dunks. Let's go. All right, so if we look here, this lob dunk felt the best of the day. And as soon as I did it, I did a lob dunk, try, I mean a dribble dunk, trying to emulate that same feel. Now, as you see, I get way higher off the lob dunk. So let's see why. And let's, uh, let me show you what I'm carving in my dribble dunks that I have to unlearn and how I'm trying to relearn the right pattern so I can jump my best. So the good patterns of my lob dunk, look where I'm pushing off from. My left foot is over, almost at the free throw line, and I'm not even running that fast. I'm still rusty, I'm still coming back from this hamstring strain, and I have a big penultimate, very solid block on that right foot, almost perfect, a little slightly bent. I'm hesitating because it hurts that hamstring to block all that speed and stop all that speed, and I go very, very upright with the ball. My positioning is very good, both legs bend, which is just a sign that the, the energy transferred through both my legs balanced and i love that symmetric dunk back rimmed it it's okay so now when i go to the dribble dunk try to do the same thing but if you look look where how how much further my left foot fo is forward i didn't know this doing it i'm just trying to be as aggressive but with the lob dunks it's very natural i'm very aggressive i'm looking up at the ball i'm just attacking so i try to bring that into my dribble dunks now the good part is is i did block pretty well pretty straightforward foot i do not i don't use my arm swing so i'm very emphasizing my leg so that's why i'm hesitating even more and that's why it twists out even more and i don't get that same block as my lob dunks and i go up pretty Pretty balanced and symmetric, good timing with the rim, another back rim, but not nearly as high. So what I can learn is taking off even faster, taking off even further, pushing off this left leg even more because I'm thinking so much about the jump that I'm forgetting about the push into the take, the takeoff and the plant. So that's something I want to learn with my dribble dunks. And the more I add my dribble dunks, if I'm taking off from here with my dribble dunks and snapping the way I, I have such a big penultimate and snap right up, if I do that off the dribble, I'll be jumping really well. And the thing is, I have to unlearn the habits of jumping too close and th looking at the rim and jumping there and taking what I know and re-carving that lob technique into my dribble dunk technique. So I hope that helps. And a side note, 
Dunk Elite sent me these. So let me know if you want to see a full Dunk review, Dunk shoe review with these, but these are sexy. And I'm about to try these out, break them in. I may break them in and just save them for Dunk Camp. That'd be nasty, but super pumped. Thank you so much. This is awesome. Stay tuned for more, possibly more work with Dunk Elite in the future. Your boy's blowing. Oh, there you go. Happy with that. Thank you. Oh, oh yeah. With the left. Oh shit. There you go. One of the good things is that when I watch the video, I look like I'm going fast, but I feel like I'm barely trying. So I just feel like when I go full speed, when I'm feeling the adrenaline to go full speed, I'll be fine. Get up, boy. You ready? Ah, too high of a toss. You're right there, though. Yeah. Hello. I'm good. Hey. I don't think I've made a dunk yet. Ooh. There you go. Not as much adrenaline as last time. I have like one high day for every four days. My energy's always good and I feel healthy, but I can't have that extreme peak of a jump day every jump day. That's fine. Put a good work today onto the next. Ah! Basically as high with the full approach. That's what I wanted. I got the bounce in me. Just gotta use it correctly. For the trifecta. Nope. Okay. Ah. Uh, my goodness. What's up, bud? Yo. What's up? Steven? Yeah. Dude, I follow you on Instagram. Bro. That's dope, dude. Yeah. You put them down? I love it. Warm up, warm up. Take your time, take your time. Take your time. Woo! Hey, there you go. Not even warm. Now I gotta make one. Now he's going again. Court awareness. Get up, boy. Yeah. I see you. Warm up a bit, warm up a bit. Take a breath, take a breath. Ooh, fuck, I gotta get one. There it is. Ooh, look up the whole time. There it is. Ah, he's trying to yam it. How tall are you? There you go. Up there. What's your name? Oh, nice. Good name. How tight are you making those? You're not gonna be able to get them off. There it is. Oh, you cocked it back. Got it. Hey, too easy. There you go. All I'm saying is keep cooking. Don't let your body sit for a second. I'm sitting right now, but I'm giving you energy, so it's still amplifying. Point is, try to stay focused and disciplined and build your dreams and live limitless.